Jerdy Teresa Corey born on August 15, 1896, died on October 26, 1957, was an Austro-Hungarian-American biochemist who in 1947 was the third woman to win a Nobel Prize in Science, and the first woman to be awarded the Nobel Prize in Physiology or Medicine, for her significant role in the discovery of the course of the catalytic conversion of glycogen. Corey was born in Prague, then in the Austro-Hungarian Empire, now the Czech Republic. Jerdy was not a nickname, but rather she was named after an Austrian warship. Growing up at a time when women were marginalized in science and allowed few educational opportunities, she gained admittance to medical school, where she met her future husband Carl Ferdinand Corey in an anatomy class. Upon their graduation in 1920, they married. Because of deteriorating conditions in Europe, the couple emigrated to the United States in 1922. Jerdy Corey continued her early interest in medical research, collaborating in the laboratory with Carl. She published research findings co-authored with her husband, as well as publishing singly. Unlike her husband, she had difficulty securing research positions, and the ones she obtained provided meager pay. Her husband insisted on continuing their collaboration, though he was discouraged from doing so by the institutions that employed him. With her husband Carl and Argentine physiologist Bernardo Jose, Jerdy Corey received the Nobel Prize in 1947 for the discovery of the mechanism by which glycogen, a derivative of glucose, is broken down in muscle tissue into lactic acid and then resynthesized in the body and stored as a source of energy, known as the Corey cycle. They also identified the important catalyzing compound, the Corey ester. The Corys were the third ever married couple to win the Nobel Prize. In 2004, both Jerdy and Carl Corey were designated a National Historic Chemical Landmark in recognition of their work in clarifying carbohydrate metabolism. In 1957, Jerdy Corey died after a 10-year struggle with myelosclerosis. She remained active in the research laboratory until the end of her life. She received recognition for her achievements through multiple awards and honors. Thanks for watching Herdery Channel. Don't forget to like the video and subscribe our channel.